my feeling is that in a process where you are trying, where the political process is going to work itself out, and where you are going to put in place a new political system, a new political mechanisms of decision making and so on, these times usually are not good for major economic reforms or social reforms. Uh, we know that the challenges that need to be dealt with are big, huge, uh, which need deep reforms. We need deep reforms in the social safety net system. We need deep reforms in the education system. We need deep reforms into the business uh, environment, the banking system, uh, financial systems, uh, you know, government, uh, government uh, systems, and so on. We know all of that, and everybody realizes that. The question is, how much can you do when the political process is very fragile and is unable, and this brings me to the question I was asking about the advanced democracies where decision-making to make tough decisions is not easy. In, in well-established democracies, how about when it is done in fragile, emerging, budding democracies? So my view is that it will be uh, too optimistic to expect in the next phase uh, deep reforms to be undertaken in, in a very significant way. Uh, now the question is, if this does not, if this is the case, if this is the case, where is the growth going to come from that is going to support the political process in terms of creating high growth rates and high uh, job creation rates? And that is really the biggest challenge that we have. My, my belief, my thinking is that actually we do have reserves for growth which are not really dependent on new reforms. I may be wrong on this, but that's my belief. We have always said, actually, I always said, and I think with Ahmed we talked about it many times, that we always believed that in the Arab region there was the potential growth rate was much higher than it was in the last 20 years or more. The average growth rate was in the last period was four to five percent, and we always that the fundamentals as they exist, you know, will support a higher growth rate of seven percent or more. And the missing, the, the critical point and that we pointed out to is the governance issues. So by focusing on the governance issues and on the political process, this in itself to my understanding, will create the conditions for the high growth rate and the job creation.